TikTok, Dimi Double Vanilla, if you want more content. There's so much amazing fashion. I have so much street style coming. And let's go to the first store. Okay, first of all, look how gorgeous this display is. I love all the pompous grass. I actually have a full flagship Dior Milan vlog, so if that's not already posted, stay tuned for that. I just wanted to, to give a kind of a quick overview. This over here is from their new collection. It's got the whole city of Paris on it. You can see, first of all, gorgeous, ready to wear over here, in little ruffle details. And again, yeah, this is like the Arc de Triomphe, the entire city center of Paris, which is gorgeous. And I love these boots. Well, this beautiful ready to wear piece over here. These boots over here are amazing, they're gorgeous. These cute little saddle bags. And let's head to the next store, maybe Salem Raw. I'm gonna take you around everywhere. Bottega, Bottega actually has a great new spring collection. Love this little lemon yellow color over here. This is one of their newer bags. And then these are some of the cassette bags in their new spring colors. So pretty, the pastels. I've got this taupey color over here, some creams. I actually have been loving this nice bag over here from the Let me show you guys how that looks. Such a cute little size. And this one with the ruching is super interesting. It's just the smaller version of that. We have the classic leather over here. These cute little bucket bags over here. Are adorable. This is the flat version of the cassette bag versus the puffy version. And then they also have so many cool sunglasses. These definitely won't suit me, but let's try it on. Uh, Bottega makes such cool sunglasses. Let me show you the little mini Jody. I love this cracked leather over here. Kind of like a reddish brown. A little bit hard to see but it's so cute. You can really see the color and the lighting. They've got these great little shoes over here. I'm gonna quickly show you these. So pretty. Again I love this little bag over here. And then they brought back some clutches. Like Bottega used to be known for their clutches right and then they really didn't have many if any for a while. New collection has these amazing clutches so nice love this one in black they also have it in beautiful cream and i really love this one with the amazing little handle over here this is such a gorgeous piece let me take you to the next store again spring colors i love these so much they're so good let's go to the next store and as you guys can see milan fashion is insane there's so much cool outfits here everywhere i'm going i'm seeing such great fashion so, inside Saint Laurent, love the classic envelope clutch. Their bracelets are always amazing. They're super statement. Same with their card cases are always so nice. It's like a little cape, mini cape card holder with the tassel. I really love that. And envelope bags. And then look at all of these sac de jour. So here. in black. Silver hardware. They also have the, uh, what is this one called? Named after New York. The Madison. It's a, it's a New York inspired piece. We've got this cute little one over here. I really like the patent. This has the suede. They've got this cute little one over here in the suede. This one in the canvas. And then over here, there's this little ostrich piece. And then over here, they've got some spring colors. Yellow, purple. Some of that green is so pretty. And then I love their cabas tote. These are very simple and classic tote. I love the black one. They have their Senka set bags. I love this one with the yellow. So it's actually the coolest one I've seen so far. Such a great bag. This would look good all seasons. Like I think this is great for the summertime. I love the antique gold hardware. And then the purple one. Again, very cool. It's a uh, snake skin with the antique gold. This is nice as well. It's got patent. It's just so black. It's actually really cool. I always love this bag. It's really nice. And then they have 
this one over here with the little crystals. I don't know the name of these, but what a great piece. This is definitely new because I have not seen this one before. And again, in that yellow, they've got their cake tassel bags over here. Amazing. Really cute. So hopefully you guys enjoyed Saint Laurent. And let's check out some Celine next. Okay, so we're at Celine. And again, more fall colors. Such a cute shampoo. There's some gray. I love the crayon bags over here. There's some metallics. I definitely prefer the shape over the round is the belt. Love the classic black one. There's the monogram, the brown one. And then check out these little I want to give you guys some eye candy and overview. This one is really pretty. Again, this is what I'm looking for. Something I've never seen before to show you guys because I feel like I've shown you guys all of these classic ones. Um, these with the little crystals I've never seen and it's so cute. You can't fit your phone in there, but it's good for like car holder, some essentials. This, the silver is really nice. Okay, I want to show you a little bit of Margiela because it's such an interesting brand. It's a pretty cool color. Here's this one. These little Margiela bags. They're so cute. Let me know what you think of Margiela. I do like their little puff bags. There's some Longchamp. Let's see what this is. This is Ferragamo, which is I believe an Italian brand. These are actually really cool shapes. Interesting, different, something that like not a lot of people are wearing. These Ferragamo bags. These are their more classic top ones. And I do like the lock mechanism. It's, it's really interesting. The orange one, classic black. But yes, these are very cool actually. Some Versace top handle and let me show you I wish I had some Versace jewelry up here so here are some the Jirashi shark boots what do we think of those? I like the classic shark boots not like those little rubber ones this is such a cute little piece it's like a little pouch bag and I love the shape that's beautiful there is the Jirashi lock earrings very statement and chalky. All of their jewelry is. So there's this really interesting metallic pink. What do we think about metallics? I'm not really a fan of them. Love the lock on their new Antigona bags. Um, yeah, pretty neat. And then there's this green one over here. This little black one. So this is all new collection. Now this I love this baby pink. It's so pretty. It's got the silver hardware. Again, that new lock detail. This cute little mini one. Again, it doesn't fit your phone, but it will fit like, you know, card case, little essentials. It's magnetic opening. And then they have the long version of this bag that they've made. Again, it's all magnetic opening and it's got a little crossbody strap. It's a little bit thicker, which is I think goes really nicely with the bag. It is mixed metal, so gold and silver. There's these Jirashi bags, which I don't think I've ever seen actually. They've got their classic logo. There's some Cartier down there. And maybe we should look at some jewelry and go look at some Cartier. There's this bag that I really like. This is the puzzle bag. want to watch and what you want to see because I am obviously going to different cities and 
I do feel like you guys have seen a lot of this, most of this before, so I want to show you what you guys want to see. So please let me know what stores you want, um, and I will definitely go. This one, the hardware, as you can see, same with the blue. It's all the same color. This little Balenciaga hourglass bag. This is like the floppy leather one. Really pretty spring colors. This little pink one. Yellow one. The colors are so cute. They're like little candy colors. And then they've got their Roman rock stud over here. Big studs. Again, you're seeing this at Dior everywhere. These little Mary Jane shoes. They're actually neat. They're cute, but they're not that flattering, I don't think. And then these gorgeous little crystal bags. We've got this one with the little sequins. This one's so pretty. This little purple one. And then they've got the longer version ones over here in purple and yellow. And then check out this little crystal one over here. So pretty really good in the light. They've got this little, what would we call this again, clear bag, clear plastic bag with the crystals. Don't like this, but let me know what you guys think of that one. See, every brand is doing the long version. So there's the classic Sisley bag over there. They've got a mini long version. They've got this long version. And now I'm scared because I see almost every brand doing these clear bags and they're not good. What do we think about the clear bags? No. There's the black pageant, which actually looks really nice. I like the shine to that. And I do always like the long versions. They look really cool. And then Fendi. Look at these boots. First of all, the peekaboo is really cool with these little side details. These boots, these are like rain boots, I guess. Very interesting. This little ready to wear piece. And then check this out. Has the silver hardware. So much silver hardware, which is cool. This green is so vibrant. They've got some of their baguette bags over here. This little canvas one, white, green, taupe one, pink. These are so cute. And then the rings. Always love their little jewelry pieces. Some silver pieces. Earrings, bracelets, and they have more green up there. They've got that python bag. Again, the black one with the long tassels. And then that is pretty much it for Fendi. So let's go see some Gucci. Really cute spring colors. I did go to the flagship Gucci, so there'll be a full Gucci vlog. They're bringing back so much of their Marmot collection, which I do not like. I just feel like it's so, it just doesn't look good. But I'm not sure if I'll be able to go inside Louis Vuitton, but I will show you the Louis Vuitton display over here. This is their luggage. Their display is really cool. But I will try to show you a little bit in here if I can. So cute little piece of paper. I'm going to do a bag, a little keychain, earrings, bracelets. This is all their costume jewelry. I'm just going to try to show you guys as much as I can. This is a newer piece over here. They've got their Pachetti tea. What do we think about the Pachetti tea? Do we still like it or not? I think in the regular monogram, it's a great color. But in these big monogram colors, it's just... I think a lot of people are kind of over the big monogram. Here are the twist bags over here in Epi Leather. This little two-tone beige. As I promised you guys, I would show you some Cartier. So there's some Cartier watches here. I'm gonna go through all of them closely. I know so many of you love the Cartier watches. This has a crocodile strap. Stainless steel. This one's really interesting. This little small one. So this is called the French one, the French tank. The American. This here is the Santos. This is another version of that. There's this one. 
And then this is the panther one, which is definitely the most popular, at least right now. This is a little baby one in gold and steel. And there's a few more on the other side that I'm going to show you. And then there's these Cartier watches over here. These ones with a little diamond bezel. This one, so many diamonds. This pink one. And that is gonna wrap it up for the Cartier section and now let's head to the next section. Okay guys, we are up on the shoe level and let me show you some of their shoes. So, their mock and mock display is really cool. I mean, look how pretty it is with all the ruffles, bow details. I love the way they put this little display together. They've got some Margiela over here. These crazy shoes. People just love these. There's some Jack Mousse over here. They always make interesting things. Imagine you see someone wearing these shoes walking down the street. Very cool. Um, these lots of satin for Jacquemus. Over here it has his logo. Really interesting. Okay, we're in the Chanel area. I'm going to quickly show you. They don't have that much on display, but I'm going to show you a little bit. They've got some other sneakers over here. Really cute. Classic, their colors. They have quite a lot actually. Some really classic pieces. And then this tweed one. These little flats over here. These are really cool from Chanel, their new collection. They're like a little cowboy boot, which I love. And then let me show you these little boots. These are very classic over here. They don't have prices, unfortunately, but I would share with you guys. And these are so cute. Look at the little bow and the pearls. And they've got these little sock boots. They also have them in black with the pearl detail. They've got these sling bags with the crystals, the flat version, lots of ballet flats, and some sandals. Over here, they've got some denim. These over here, these little blue ones. These over here, lots of navy blue. These little sandals. These ones over here, oh, this is really cool. These ones with the crystals. There's these little um, sequin ones over here in pink. These ones. There's these with the chains, but it is flashing behind, so it's a little bit hard to see. It's too bad about that. And then these are those little chunky sandals. I love the gold hardware on those. Let's see who makes these. Oh, these are Saint Laurent. These are very cool. There's a bunch of fake Saint Laurent boots. I love their little logo over there. And then this is just like a little overview of the St. Laurent shoes, Jimmy Choo. And I think that's going to wrap it up for the shoe section. Alright guys, I really hope you enjoyed this vlog. There's so much here. I love you guys so much. I hope you're enjoying the vlog content. Make sure you're subscribed. Follow me on Instagram and on TikTok. It's just TV Double Vanilla. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! I'm